Greetings, I'm Bob Ritterleff, founder of Global Innovation Strategies, and I want to be the first to welcome you to Galactic Drive-In, a momentous exploration of human creativity. As you are undoubtedly aware, tonight we are partnering with Empire Drive-In for one night to blast off into low Earth orbit, where we're offering a preview of the first art gallery in space. I know, it's unbelievable, right? Once in orbit, you will encounter monumental works that push the boundaries of how we create, access, and encounter art. It's a bold and audacious experiment, and we are so proud to share it with you tonight. Where did this incredible idea come from, you may ask? Here at Global Innovation Strategies, our motto is simply innovating access to creativity. Knowing that art is central to human progress, we invest heavily and solutions that transform the world into a more prosperous home for all. At a recent board meeting, we were brainstorming new areas of growth for the coming years. After recent successes in Manhattan and Brooklyn, we discussed good old Queens here, depressed Rust Belt cities, and third world countries. But that night, on my way home, something in the sky caught my eye. I gazed into that dark, vast nothingness above us and realized I was looking at the true culture vacuum. Yes, space is an actual vacuum, but think of the lack of creativity and productivity, all the untapped resources all around us, right above every man, woman, and child on this planet. Here in New York City, we pay exorbitant rent on veritable shoeboxes for the chance to create and express ourselves, while just a few dozen miles above us, free unused space stretches further than the eye can see a lot closer to us than other hubs of culture like London or Paris or Dubai. Creativity is, as we know, one of the most effective tools for lifting a community's standard of living. Culture is a proven engine for turning vast, unwanted, underutilized spaces into new hubs of exciting and innovative commerce. Art is the catalyst for bustling economies, healthy industries, and robust communities. Tonight, we open a new cultural frontier. Tonight marks the beginning of a new space race. A space race for art. From everyone here at Global Innovation Strategies, thank you for joining us on this truly momentous occasion. See you among the stars. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your chief space flight attendant. On behalf of the captain and the entire crew, hello and welcome aboard the Flux spacecraft, the only spacecraft of its kind in our universe, providing non-stop service to space and back. Our flight time will consist of two hours and 30 minutes at a record speed of one million miles per hour. Now, we request your full attention as the flight attendants demonstrate the safety features of this spacecraft and instruct you on how to prepare yourself and your vehicle in case of space emergency. Please make sure your vehicle is in the parked position. Engage the emergency brake to keep your place in space. Please get out of your vehicle and kick your tires to ensure a steady ride. For your enjoyment, zero gravity snacks will be provided. Due to FAA spaceflight restrictions, Pop Rocks are strictly forbidden on this flight. Open up your glove box to find the materials to construct your radiation protection helmet. Please take a moment to make your helmet. If you need to move about the cabin during zero gravity, please strap on your magnetic gravity boots. Remember to distract your driver. If you need to spew, spew into this.
For your safety, oxygen, air pressure, and radiation levels are always being monitored. In the event of decompression, goggles and oxygen masks will appear in front of you. To start the flow of oxygen, place your mask firmly over your mouth. Place your goggles firmly over your eyes so they don't pop out of your head. In the event of a comet or space debris collision, the captain will press the special asteroid alarm. Place your beverage down and immediately assume the bracing position. Lean forward, bend over, place your head between your legs, and accept your fate. In the event of space flamingos, bang on the sides of your vehicle to scare them away. In the event of an alien occurrence, defend yourselves with the provided rubber bands. In the event you are jettisoned from your spacecraft, emergency space preservers can be found under your seat. Please take a moment to see where your nearest exit is. Remember, it might be behind you. At this time, please turn off all electronic devices, including mobile phones, pagers, radios, and remote controlled tools. These items might interfere with the navigational equipment and allow non-Earthlings to track our movement. Thank you for your attention. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask one of our crew members. We wish you all an enjoyable and historic flight.